The OptiShot 2 is one of the cheapest golf simulators on the market, but it still packs a very respectable punch. For just under £400, you get a decent practice area and driving range, access to 15 real-life golf courses, and some decent feedback and data about your golf swing too. Some of the world famous golf courses you can play include TPC Scottsdale and Torrey Pines. Also, for a respectable additional fee, you can buy more golf courses, including the likes of Pebble Beach. The feedback that you receive after each shot includes data on your club head speed, club face angle, swing path, and your total distance. When you purchase the OptiShot 2, you're given two foam golf balls. However, you can also use real golf balls, but it's a nice option to have if you want to set up your simulator indoors. However, with the OptiShot 2, you don't actually need to use a golf ball at all. There are sensors that simply pick up your club head as it swings through, calculating all of its data from that. Some people like the idea of this, but it is not always the most realistic golfing experience and can often lead to some inaccurate data being presented on the screen. When playing the courses, you have many customizable features, so you can change the wind speed and the direction if you wish to, and also change the firmness of the greens and the fairways. On top of this, you also have access to OptiShot Live, which enables you to play online against other people from all over the world. But being an entry-level launch monitor does have its setbacks, and the graphics are not as lifelike as other slightly more expensive golf simulators on the market. Chipping and putting around the greens are not the most realistic and you actually have to tell the OptiShot which club you're using before each shot that you hit, which can become a bit of a bore and if you forget to do this, it will give you a very inaccurate reading of your shot. Overall, for less than £400, the OptiShot 2 can give you enough reliable data to help you improve your golf game, as well as providing hours of fun on the courses that it comes with. It's super easy and simple to set up with just a USB lead to plug in and an app to download. For an entry level golf simulator at a reasonable price, it's not a bad place to start. A step up from the OptiShot 2 is Skytrack. And Skytrack is widely considered to be the most value for money home golf simulator on the market. Coming in at just under £2,000, it's a very accurate launch monitor providing data on carry distances and ball speeds that are comparable to other high-end launch monitors such as the Trackman. Skytrack also provides data on spin rate, total distance, launch angle and club head speed, although some of these numbers are calculations rather than accurate recordings. There are some brilliant features within the Skytrack software which is simply an app that you download and install. The basic driving range package that comes included with the launch monitor, for example, allows you to not only see your ball flight and carry distances, you can select to aim to hit fairways and greens, as well as a feature called the randomizer, which switches between distances and allows you to work on your short game. For an extra £100 a year, you can upgrade the Skytrack software to the game improvement plan, which gains you access to additional features such as closest to the pin and long drive contests, and also the fantastic skills assessment, club mapping and wedge matrix features. All of which are designed to help you improve your accuracy and all around golf game. Once you've got access to this game improvement plan, you can then also purchase some third party softwares that allow you to play some golf courses. For example, you can play two of the most popular golf simulator packages on the market, the Golf Club 2019 and E6 Connect. These are an amazing addition, converting your launch monitor into a very realistic and a highly nice. enjoyable home golf simulator. Yes, the cost of these on top of your Skytrack and game improvement plan right, aren't cheap, this one in. This but if you ask 30. anyone who's purchased them, 99% will tell you that it's definitely worth the money. Skytrack is great for indoor use and even outside at the driving range when you're hitting from a mat. This makes it a great option for a home golf simulator. However, it's not as reliable and much more difficult to use if you're hitting from grass. So it's not very good if you're using it outside. There's also a protective metal case that is almost essential that you purchase with your Skytrack. Yet, this isn't provided with the launch monitor and it's going to set you back another £150. All in all, the Skytrack is an extremely popular and more importantly an affordable choice for those looking to invest in a solid all-round home golf simulator.
Flightscope's latest offering, the Mevo Plus, is an upgrade from its predecessor, the Flightscope Mevo. And rather than simply being a launch monitor, the Mevo Plus is another excellent and affordable choice for those looking to purchase a home golf simulator. The Mevo Plus comes in at around £2,000, which is similar to the Skytrack, yet it offers a couple of features which the Skytrack doesn't. For example, with every purchase of the Mevo Plus, you gain access not only to its software and driving range functions, but it comes with five free golf courses on E6 Connect. So not only can you work on your golf swing, you can play courses and have fun straight out of the box. The Mevo Plus is also a more inclusive and popular option, as this launch monitor allows both left and right handed golfers to play together without having to move the unit before each shot like you do with the Skytrack. Its radar Doppler tracking system is a much easier way to play together with friends compared to Skytrack's infrared camera design. It also makes it a great option for outdoor use and hitting off grass rather than just an artificial mat. However, the drawback here for the Mevo Plus is that you need a much larger space to play as it requires around 2 meters behind the ball and 2 meters in front of the ball to accurately track your ball flight. In total, you need a space that is around 15 feet in length to be able to use this launch monitor, which not everyone on a budget has. All in all, this is another fantastic option for your home golf simulator, providing you with all the data a regular club golfer will need to help improve their game, and also have access to playing world-famous golf courses from the comfort of your own home. You can also upgrade your Mevo Plus software to access the Golf Club 2019 if you wish, or the full package of E6 Connect for an extra expense. Foresight Sports GC2 launch monitor is a level up from the Skytrack and Mevo Plus. This is an extremely popular launch monitor for the lower handicap golfer, golf teaching professionals and the indoor golf simulator enthusiast. However, coming in at around the £6,000 mark, it is a much more expensive investment. The benefits of the GC2 include highly accurate and game building performance data including the usual spin rates, carry distances, launch angles and ball speed. However it also provides you with swing path, club face angle and angle of attack. These parameters are actually displayed on the launch monitor itself and therefore some computer software is not necessarily required. This also makes the GC2 a great option to take out to the driving range with you and hit from the grass for a more realistic feedback rather than simply using a range map. The only drawback to this is that the unit is not the most compact launch monitor and therefore it's not the easiest to cart from place to place. On the other hand it is ideal to keep indoors inside your home golf simulator room or studio. If you do wish to have access to a visual display of your ball fly and the data within your home golf simulator then you do need to purchase Foresight Sports' FSX license, which is a costly expense coming in at around an extra £2,000. The FSX license is a very impressive interface with loads of visual data to help the lower handicap golfer and golf professionals work on their game. If you are simply interested in playing golf courses though, and not necessarily the driving range feature, many people tend to just buy the Golf Club 2019 for half the price, and use it for the driving range feature within that, as well as gaining access to over 100,000 courses. Many entry-level Skytrack owners do tend to upgrade to Foresight's GC2 if they become fully invested in the home golf simulator experience. The GC2 provides more accurate data and more reliable ball flights and tracking, as well as less misreading or no reading of shots, which can be common with the cheaper launch monitors. Overall, the GC2 is a trusted, popular and professional grade launch monitor that is for the experienced golfer or teaching pro. For an indoor golf simulator experience, you can't go wrong with the GC2 as long as you can afford it. A step up and an upgrade from the GC2 is Foresight Sports GC Quad, which is one of the two top end leading launch monitors in the world and it's used by many elite golfers on the PGA Tour. The accuracy and reliability of the GC Quad is absolutely amazing and your yardages, club speed and other feedback data it provides is second to none, being reliable and consistent both indoors and out. It's smaller and more compact than the GC2, however it's still not the most portable of launch monitors in this list. 
However, it does weigh just seven and a half pounds and it will run for between six to eight hours on its lithium ion battery. A combination of high resolution, high speed camera based technology and infrared object tracking build a virtual 3D model of your golf swing and precisely measures club head and ball performance. The results are delivered almost immediately with no delay like in some cheaper launch monitors. You can also purchase additional features to the GC Quad including putting analysis software and also the FSX software itself which will allow you to play world famous golf courses in extremely high detail and accuracy. The drawback of all this amazingness is of course the price. The GC Quad launch monitor itself will set you back around £15,000 and if you want the simulator experience then expect an additional 2000 for the FSX software. You can however still play the Golf Club 2019 and E6 Connect using the GC Quad if you want to save a little bit of money and have what some people consider to be a better simulator experience. As the name suggests there are some predecessors to the Trackman 4 with this one being the latest installment to the Trackman series. With its dual laser technology, the TrackMan 4 launch monitor will provide you with ample amounts of data to interpret your golf game. To put it simply, one of the lasers tracks everything to do with your golf club, such as face and path angles, where the other laser tracks everything to do with the ball, like your launch angle and spin rates. To try and put it into some sort of summary, every single detail of the golf swing is captured with the TrackMan 4 in the highest precision possible even including the location of impact on your club face. A total of 27 parameters can be delivered in real time, including all the ones you've come to expect from all the other launch monitors. Trackman has become the gold standard in launch monitor and swing analysis technology, and it's used by many of the world's best professionals, equipment manufacturers, coaches, and club fitters. Despite its abundance of technology, it comes in a relatively small package weighing only 6.2 pounds and only 30 centimeters in height and width. However, there is of course the small detail of the price, which comes in around a whopping 17,000 pounds, which rules many of us club golfers well and truly out of the game. On top of all of its glorious and instant swing and feedback data, Trackman also has its own simulator experience called Virtual Golf 2 that you can purchase at an additional cost. Trackman claims this to be the most realistic and in-depth golf simulator experience around, with an abundance of real-life, world-famous courses available. A complete Trackman setup, however, may well set you back into multiple tens of thousands of pounds, so it's probably best to save this kind of setup for the elite-level golfers or those people that are fortunate enough to have that kind of money to spare.